What the hell is that? Oh, what else is over here? Oh my gosh! What the freak? He just did he just spawn in there? Doing lads and welcome to Siren Head Awakening. Um, I think we're going to awaken Siren Head. Um, I don't know. Nothing really gives that hint off, but I just think we might. Um, Siren Head, it's if you don't know what it is, um, you're living under a rock, and uh, yeah, you just yeah. He's like this massive, tall, really tall figure that lives in the woods and that makes siren sounds from the side, the two sirens on his head. I, I loved him so much back in 2020. He is a uh, 2020 kind of creepypasta and I, I loved him so much. I even drew pictures of him and me and my cousin and one of my mates, we went into, um, we went into the park, we brought a speaker this one time and we played siren head noises thinking it was going to play throughout the entire park but it was kind of embarrassing when it was not that loud and people were just staring at us. We tried to play a prank and freak people out. It didn't work, it was a fail. Um, people were looking at us, very weird. But if you enjoy this video, make sure to like and subscribe and turn on notifications while you're at it. Enjoy the video, lads. Who really cares about this stuff, honestly? Just continue. All right, this is uh, this is the main boy right here. Uh, Siren Head, normal baby hard and custom, which we haven't unlocked yet. Let's do, um, let's just go normal. I like playing these games normally, you know, some other YouTubers like going hard and extreme at it. Pause on that, but I just like doing normal. Okay, we got a cutscene. I almost skipped that. Siren Head Awakening! Friday, March 21, 1997. I was not born then. Welcome to Siren Head Awakening. You find yourself in the middle of the dark forest with, <coughs> forest with nothing but a flashlight. You must find four car parts scattered across the map to repair your broken down car and escape. Due to physical li limitations, you can only hold one car part at a time. Right. Um, finding car parts among other items also seems to anger the beast that lurks in the shadows. Siren Head. Let's talk about him. So our car's broken down. We need to find these car parts. I don't know too much about cars. I can't just name cars on the streets randomly but yeah stamina is an important part of of your life when sprinting through the woods you're very vulnerable without without it so use it wisely yes your flashlight is also a vulnerable tool but be sure to turn off your to, to <laughs> your flashlight is also a vulnerable tool but be sure to turn it off when you hear siren head nearby or else he'll get or else you get hunted Okay, I thought it said he'll get hunted. Um, when being hunted, it is a good idea to try and find shelter while running away. Siren Head cannot reach, cannot reach for you if you're if you're inside a building or vehicle. I can't read today. Um, use what you learn to try and escape. Good luck. That is me trying to read with my reading difficulties right there. The sensitivity is so slow. All the way to the max. There we go. That's good sensitivity. All right. All right, we don't have any car parts. My stamina is down there at the bottom. This looks like Slender Man. I haven't seen that game in a while. If you want me to play that, you already know what to do. Smack that like button and um, just let me know. You know, game looks clean. Uh, not the best graphics, but it looks clean as hell. So that's that's all I'm going for it. There's a pathway down here. We walk so slow. I'm just gonna use all my stamina. I know they said to use it wisely, but. I don't care. Oh, we might find some car parts in here. A broken down little bus. So this is no car parts in here by the looks of it. But ooh, yeah, we're gonna need that for when we see the big boy. No, I'm actually scared. Hang on. Why am I scared? Is this? <gasps> He's pissed. He's pissed. We could only hold one at a time. It said. I remember that. All right. That's so loud. Added gas in the uh, container, canister, whatever it said. Oh, this is a petrol station. <gasps> is that Minecraft Steve? Good evening. Oh. A dish us. Okay. Oh, <gasps> spark plug. Oh, I've got an inventory. Wait, hang on. I didn't realize that. Close these. Oh, okay. So there's notes as well. Um. I just want to know, before I leave, is there anything else in here? This, uh, they're definitely going for a Slenderman theme with this. Throw this in here. Just hide. Maybe? Hide? Should I? 
What do you reckon? Should I hide? What the hell is that? <gasps> My jumping. Is that him? Because that doesn't sound like him. Oh, house is over here. Oh my gosh! What the freak? He just did he just spawn in there? Go 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 go! Bloody hell! Oh, he can't reach me in here. He can't reach me in here. Oh! Huh? Did I just see his hand through the? Oh, that scared me so bad. I'm going to slap something. I'm going to slap someone. I'm going to slap him. Siren Head's like one of my biggest fears all of a sudden. Like, no. These aren't like hiding places. Oh. Run. Run. One more part. One to go. As Thanos would say, one to go. I'm really actually scared. No. I, ha I hate playing horror games on the channel. I wonder if I should stop doing horror games and start doing something else. Because these genuinely scare me so bad. I'm actually... Like, I'm not just saying this for a video, but... I'm not saying this just for the video, but... I genuinely am in fear right now. Like, this, this is a genuine face of fear. Why do I get... You're not catching up to me today. I think he's catching up to me. Oh, the petrol station's all the way over there. Bro, I'm really about to oh, bloody hell, his sirens turned off, but he's still after me. Big bro is just standing there. <coughs> I'm choking on fear. He's still standing there. He's literally a freak. He's useless. He's got nothing going on with his life right now. Oh. Wait, have we been to that area? I don't think we have. Oh, you dumb siren. Could he? He can't reach us in here, right? Could he? Nah. He's dumb. It's kind of annoying as well because he blends in with the trees. Like, I guess that's kind of why he's built like that. No. Are you kidding? No. I need a passcode to get into these useless houses. I think I've lost my car as well. I don't know where my car's at. <gasps> That's the last part, lads. Oh, bloody hell. Bloody hell. Oh, he's faster. Bloody hell. How did you get me? How? I was inside a vehicle. How did you get me? I honestly don't understand. I don't get how he got me. That is so annoying. I was on my last part. It said that, like... I, if I hide in a vehicle, then we chill. But we not chill. I'm probably gonna leave the petrol station till last. Because... That's the closest to the car. Now I wonder if they all spawn in the same spot. Because that would be pretty good if they did. It appears they don't. Alright, first part, righty. Chuck us that, lad. Also, something I just realised. When I got jump scared by Siren Head. I recognize that jump scare sound. Was that the prowler? Bloody hell! How did you get me? Next one's right there. He's gonna come for me. And he spawns right there. He is right over there. Never mind, never mind. He can't get me. He can't reach for me in here. It said that at the beginning. Okay, surely, come on, one of these houses has to have the third item, and I know the last one has to be at the petrol station. Like, it's literally not an option, it, it has to be, like, I'm actually forcing it to be there. <gasps> there it is. Oh, wait, there's a note as well. Now, someone is going to be very mad at me, and, and he starts with an S and ends with an idiot. <laughs> I just 
would very much like to check if the next item is in there. Yep, spark plug. That. Oh. So. It switches. Throw that in and run. Run. Go. Go. Escape. Let's go. Three achievements for that. Alrighty then. Vroom vroom. Now let's run him over. Nah, we're gonna die if we do that. Alright, yeah, just drive off. Go back home. Report this to the police. Um, the trouble that came with collecting your car parts. The terror, the, the terror filled in your heart through the journey. You've managed to repair the car, ready for escape. But the loud booming footsteps seem ever closer than before. You've, you've never been so terrified in your life. You graciously made an escape never to return again. You live to tell the tale. You escaped alive. Well lads, I hope you've enjoyed this video. Be sure to recommend some more Siren Head games if you've enjoyed this one. I enjoy this game. Horror games are very, very scary things for me. I don't know why I still play them. I think it's because I do it for you guys. So please, if you must, just smash the like button, subscribe, and while you're at it, turn on the notification bell. But in the meantime, enjoy your day lads. Keep it on a DL, or you gon' see seashells. The only way I leave well, in the box like emails.